Hi, John with VersaFeed here. Today we're going to take a quick look at how to add AdWords labels to your Google Merchant Center feed. So first we're going to go ahead and get to the Merchant Center dashboard. We're going to go ahead and hover over Feeds and then click Feed Modifications. You can do all kinds of different mods here. Today we're going to look only at how to create an AdWords label. So we'll go ahead and click Create New Rule. The first thing we want to do is name the rule. You can put whatever you want here. AdWords label equals shoes. This is just a moniker for you to remember what the purpose of the rule was. Next we'll go ahead and check which products we want to set the label with. So go ahead and click this. Here you can pretty much use any different attribute to choose how we're going to set the label. So for example you could say title contains the word shoe. And that would make us an AdWords label in the Google Merchant Center feed whenever it sees a title that has the word shoe. You could also do something like internal category is maybe men's shoes. Whatever kind of internal category system that you use, you would obviously need to match here. You can also set multiple criteria here if you want. So we could say internal category is men's shoes and we could say price greater than 100. You could set a brand here as well if you wanted to add another filter. And then lastly we're going to tell it to actually generate the AdWords label when it sees these criteria matched. So in the edit fields area we'll do a set. We're going to select custom field here. It's the very last one. And then we'll type out AdWords labels. And this needs to be typed exactly because this is what's going to go into the feed. We'll then go ahead and click on this incomplete here. And we will select type to constant value. And this is where you're going to put the actual label itself. So it might be something like shoes 100 or whatever you want. But make sure this matches inside of Google AdWords where you create your product targets. You want to lastly select which feed you're going to use. Obviously in this case it's going to be Google. And then we're going to go ahead and click save. Now that would generate one AdWords label for the feed once it's regenerated. Now that typically takes about every 24 hours. If you want the feed regenerated immediately, you can email us at support at versafeed.com and one of the team members here will generate the feed and then send an email back to you. And that's how you make AdWords labels via the VersaFeed dashboard. Thanks.